now i will tell you how to assign the calendars previously in the start we have defined the calendars as head office calendar and site calendar so if you want to check i will go to the enterprise and go to the calendars option here you can see that i have created the head office calendar and site calendar so it is very important to understand that uh, there should be uh, one of the uh, calendar selected as a default when you create a project uh, the purpose of that uh, uh, setting the default is that when you define the project automatically that uh, calendar will be applied to that project uh, i have uh, not uh, selected as a default so that i can tell you that why uh, how it is uh, not applied to our project previously uh, the other calendar was set as a default uh, so I will go to the assign calendar options so I will go to one of the activity for example project start I will go to the general tab you have to enable this activity detail if it is not available so you can see here the activity calendar is set as standard five day work week which is not correct so the purpose of not uh, uh, showing the correct calendar so that if you uh, assign the wrong calendar how you can rectify it so you can just simply click this one and you will uh, select the required calendar i am going to select as a head office calendar here but uh, uh, it will take a long time to do uh, each and every activity then engineering start you will you will say that it is the head office activity you will assign the head office calendar procurement is also going to conduct in head office so you are going to assign it as it is construction obviously it will uh, happen on the side so i we should assign the uh, site calendar and project completion you can assign head office calendar no issue no but this is a very uh, long and tiring effort to uh, apply all the activities there is one shortcut so that you can assign the calendar within few minutes without any tiring efforts so first of all delete this successor details column because we are not more required so i'm going in the columns option and uh, moving this successor detail to the left side activity list now i want to uh, uh, see the calendar uh, tab on the uh, column field so i will find uh, calendar find next it is available in the general tab so if you don't know then you can find by uh, control f or otherwise you have an option that uh, uh, you can simply go and select the option so here i have displayed the column of calendar so you can see here the <clears throat> we have assigned the wrong calendar we have to rectify it so it's very simple general kick off meeting I'm going to assign the head office calendar so here you can also assign the calendar one by one there is another option of assigning the calendar within a very few minutes architecture is going to be happen architectural design engineering is going to be happen head office so I'm going to select as a head office calendar now i will tell you the fill down option that you can fill the like in excel you can fill down the cells as well so from uh, all the engineering will be um, happened in the uh, head office so i am going to assign the head office calendar to the engineering activities even the procurement will be conducted in the head office select the first cell and highlight it will show as a highlight this one then by selecting the shift button go down till that activity on which you want to assign the 
head office calendar right click pull down you can see that head office calendar has been applied to all of the activities but don't surprise that here it is showing standard five day work week it is the ws level so you can uh, just simply refresh uh, by going into the file option refresh data or either you can press f5 it will refresh the data and you can see that on the ws level this uh, this uh, um, uh, change has been applied now go to the construction wbs the construction is going to be conducted on the side so we are going to assign the site calendar in the same way i have to change the first activity then by pressing the shift key i am going downside till that activity on which i want to apply Uh, the requisite calendar so i am going to change it by using the by right by doing the right click and applying the fill down option so here you can see that all the calendars has been set and applied to the activities as per our requirement so also do refresh for this as well you can see that impact has been applied now your calendars has been assigned and rectified as per your requirement in this way you can change the calendar if you have not uh, applied correctly at the start